guys, Kat here. And today we have a barbell hit workout. So we're gonna be using a barbell for strength moves, and then we're also gonna mix in a little bit of body weight cardio because why not? So if you don't have a barbell, you can totally use dumbbells. And remember when we're doing the cardio moves, be very careful with your barbell, set it aside so it doesn't roll into you while you're jumping around. Safety first, people. Safety first. Each exercise is gonna be 50 seconds on with 10 seconds rest. All right, let's get started. Roar. All right guys, let's get started with that warm up. You know me, we're gonna start with jumping jacks. So nice and easy. Now since this is an upper body workout, I'm gonna be using kind of lighter weight than I usually do. Um, Cause we're not gonna be doing like bunch of squats today with the barbell. So touch those hands at the top and make sure you adjust your barbell accordingly. Three, two, one. Nice job. Bounce it out. And let's go with those butt kickers. Kick that booty. Kick that booty. Yeah. Nice job. Remember we will still be using our legs today because we have, we have that cardio mixed in and that's going to be really fun. Three, two, one. Nice job. Feet out wide. Side to side. Nice and easy. Nothing too crazy. Three, two, one. And crisscross those arms. Yay. Keep it going. Now I'm using a T-grip barbell. You don't have to use that one. It just has different handles. It's pretty cool. Um, but you can use a straight bar, so no worries on that. Three, two, one. Nice job. And let's go with some air squats. Woo! <laughs> I swallowed and like this air bubble was in my nose. I don't know if you heard that. <laughs> Woo! Keep sinking it back in those heels. Press it back. Keep that chest up. Rock it back. All right, let's go two more. Last one. Nice jab, bounce it out. And let's finish it out with one more set of jumping jacks and then we'll get started. So hopefully you don't have any bad memories of jumping jacks with gym class. <laughs> Keep it up. Don't forget to touch the hands at the top. None of this business. Three. Two, one, and let's get started. All right guys, 10 seconds. We're gonna start out nice and easy. We have curls. Now again, I have a T-grip barbell, so I'm gonna be having my hands like this. But you can have them um, underhand. All right, so just bring it up and squeeze. Exhale up, inhale down. Now remember, we don't wanna swing the body. So even on the last reps, you might be like, woo, but try to squeeze your core. On the last like one or two it might happen, but yeah. Squeeze it. Keep it close to the body. Keep it controlled, even on the way down. What am I working with? I think the bar is seven pounds, 27 pounds, like 32 pounds. <laughs> Whew. Keep it going, 10 seconds. Then we're gonna go into rows. Three, two, one. Put it down if you need to take a little breaky break. We have rows and then we're gonna go right into a cardio move. So work in that back. Grab that barbell. Again, you can go underhand. Lean forward. Remember to press that weight in your heels still. So you're not leaning forward too much. Keep that weight, that stability in your heels so we're not using the lower body to help bring up the barbell. It's all about bringing it up with your back and triceps, but mainly back. So squeeze it, keep it going. So much fun. Keep your core strong. So if your lower back is starting to hurt, are you squeezing your core? Are you engaging that core? Keep it going all the way. Three, two, one. All right. Remember, we're doing cardio now, so push it away. Make sure it doesn't roll into you. Get 180 burpees. Sorry about my butt facing the camera, but it's gonna happen. So down, up, turn. 
down, up, turn. You bring your hands up because we're so excited about burpees. If you're getting dizzy, remember to turn the same way that you came from. And if that doesn't help, just stick with regular burpees. You don't have to turn. Keep it going. Keep it up, guys. Woo! So much fun. So much fun. 10 seconds. Woo! Almost there. Three, two, one. Okay. Chest press. You need to catch your breath. Come down the ground. If you have a bench or an oogie ball or whatever, use that for your upper back. And down. Squeeze it up. Down. So it's much better if you do have that bench, just so we can bring our elbows down long more. Remember, it's not about the arms. You're squeezing that chest. So ladies, squeeze those boobies. <laughs> Keep it going. Squeeze. Nice job, guys. Squeeze it. You are going to feel this in the front of the shoulders as well. Exhale up, inhale down. If you are using a bench, you will have that negative space um, on your lower back. Okay, so double high knees is next. Again, make sure you're safe. Safety for all else, double high knees. Knee, knee, ankle, ankle. Now jump into it. <laughs> Get right into it. Bring those knees up, up, up. Keep it going. Got this exercise from Melissa Ioja. Sorry if I slaughtered her last name. Keep it going. Almost there, guys. Drive it up, up, up. Tap those ankles. Tap them. Three, two. All right, curl and press. So remember, squeeze that core. Pick up your barbell safely. Curl, press. Back, down. So it's four movements. One, two, three, four. Squeeze your core so we're not leaning back, but we are protecting that lower back. Keep it up, guys. Squeeze, press, back. Down. It's going to be more difficult because we are adding that cardio. So we're trying to catch your breath, so don't think, oh, I'm not strong. You might have to drop the weight. Back, down. All right. Bring it down. Close grip rows. I'm doing an overhand, overhand grip. You can do underhand. So keep it close. Hands. Close. This will help us work that medial part of our back. So we're trying to get more in the rhomboids. Erector spinae. Squeeze. All these fancy terms we were like, sure, cat. I believe you. <laughs> Squeeze. Remember to press that weight in the heels. Whew. Keep going. After this, we're back to cardio. <laughs> your favorite. Squeeze that core. If you're not feeling the cardio today and you're just here for the strength moves, go ahead and repeat any of the moves that we just did. I know how it is. Some days you're like, I refuse to do cardio. And that's okay. Four half burpees, four side plank dips. So, dips. I think I just said dips. 
three, four, turn, one, two, three, four, come back, one, two, use your abs to bring your feet up, one, two, three, four, bring it back, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, keep it up guys, one, two, three, four, Woo. one, two, three, four, doing awesome, two, all right, yay, yay, okay, one more cardio, three switch lunges, front leg hop, come to a lunge, so one, two, three, leg, hop it up, and then switch, one, two, three, hop it, and switch, you can use light dumbbells if you want to, you don't need to, and hop, two, three, and hop, Make sure you're pressing those heels. Make sure knee isn't over the toes. Two, three, hop it, yay. One, two, three, I'll hop. One, two, three, hop. Three more seconds. Ow, oh. all right. We're using a little bit of legs and shoulders, grab a barbell, bring it in front, thrusters, bring it down, that's it. Squeeze your core, press through your heels, make sure, again, you're not hyperextending the spine, especially when you bring it up. Be strong. <laughs> Front squats are a lot more challenging, a lot more uncomfortable. <laughs> Keep it going. Almost there, last one. All right, 10 seconds. So we have narrow grip curls. Now this one, especially for the ladies, it's gonna be a little uncomfortable, it's gonna be awkward. But keep your palms close together and squeeze. And squeeze. So much fun. Now, if you're not digging this, if you're like, no, just stick with regular curls, it's totally fine. Totally understand. I don't want this move to ruin your workout. Squeeze. Squeeze that core. Woo! After this, we got jumping jack kickouts, so we're gonna go back to a cardio move. Guys, we are over halfway, so stick with me. Stick, stickly. <laughs> it's not the first time I've made that reference. Keep going. Anyone remember Stick, Stickly from Nickelodeon? Okay, go ahead, put it down. Put it down safely, away from you. Jumping jack kickouts, start with your hands at the top, clap at the bottom, or just tap, whatever. <laughs> tap it. <sighs> Land soft. We don't wanna, we don't wanna cause an earthquake. None of that business. <sighs> Nothing falling off the shelves. Be light on those joints because as much impact as you put on the ground, you're putting on your joints. And that's no bueno. We're not exercising so we can limp or be hurt or have to have a titanium knee later. We're doing it so we can do all the things we love. Yes. So keep it up. After this, we have wide grip curls. So hands are gonna be out wide. I'm doing it underhand grip, of course. Duh. <laughs> okay, so curl and bring it down. So if you 
could dumbbells, hammer curls, not hammer curls, you can do these wide grip curls, have those palms facing out. Whew. Squeeze it and down. Exhale up, inhale down. Going back to cardio again after this. How exciting. Over halfway with this move, guys. Ow. Stay with me, don't hurt your collarbones. <laughs> 10 seconds. Give me one more. One more. Squeeze those biceps. And down. Away. Away from you. Okay. Three skaters, one leg burpee. If you can't do one leg burpee, do two leg burpees. Walk it out if you need to. Everyone can do this move with modifications. One, two, three, down, up, up. One, two, three. You should be on the other side now. Down, up. Ooh, I just did a little jump. Three, down, up, and jump. Keep it going, guys. Remember, you can always walk out the skaters, which I'll show in a minute. You could step, walk it, step, walk it. Totally fine. Woo. One, two, three. And up. One, two, three. Down, up, and up. One, two, three. Whew. Woo! Okay. <sighs> Working triceps. You might need to drop the weight. Whew. No biggie. So bring it up. Behind you, press it up. Now in this one especially, you don't want to lean back. Bring it straight up, only moving the forearms down and back up. Now for you it's going to be nicer if you have a straight bar because your elbows will be in more. For me it's a little bit harder with these handles. They can't handle it. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Exhale up, inhale down. Less than 10 seconds. Ugh. And rest. Woo. Okay, put it down. You need a little bit more room for this one. If you don't have a lot of room, just stick with some mountain climbers. Start off on one side though. 10 mountain climbers, tabletop turn. One, two, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten. Flip it over, flip it over. That's it. Drive the knees in. Five, six, nine, ten. Outside leg. Over and over. Three, four, six, ten. Over and over. Keep it going. Two, four, seven, eight, nine, ten. Over. Ah. <laughs> Shoulders. Six, nine, ten. Definitely feeling it in the shoulders, in my arms. Five, six, nine, ten. Over, last one. And over. Ow. All right, a barbell thruster to triceps. So we're just combining two moves we've already done. Okay, bring it in front. Sink down, press it up. Triceps. Bring it back down. Press it up, back, remember you're like a robot, bend, back, down, okay, so don't rush the movement, oh, triceps are dead from yesterday, keep going, press, uh. Ten seconds. Almost there. Three, two, one. Oh, we're gonna burn out that upper body. Come into a plank. Just spit all over. Jump your feet in. Jump them out. So, in, out, and then bring them out to a plank jack. In, out. 
So you got narrow to wide jump in and out. Feet together, in, out, out, in, out, in. Is your upper body burning? <laughs> it should be. With this move, keep going. Keep it up, guys. This should be freaking challenging. Take a break if you need to. Walk it out. Uh, just keep jumping. Just keep jumping. Oh, oh, so gross. Okay, supine front raise, palms facing up. Okay, so best slight bend in the elbows, bring it up. Um, you might need to drop the weight. And down. Working into your deltoids. A little bit of biceps. Whew. Struggling. Exhale up. Inhale down. Okay guys, last one, last move is cardio move, crisscross, 180 squat jump, tuck, give it to me. So crisscross, sing into a squat, jump it, and tuck, crisscross, sing into a squat, jump it, and tuck. If you can't do a crisscross or um, a tuck, walk it out instead. Or do a small hop instead, okay? So you can always crisscross, squat, and then jump. Do whatever you can do today. Come on, guys. Last move of the day. And then we're cooling it down. Yes. Give me another one. Give me one more after this. No matter what time it is. Go. Done. Woo! We are done. We're cooling it down. So, let's do it. All right, guys, let's cool it down. Come on down the ground. You deserve it. <laughs> okay, so let's go ahead and have those knees bent. We're gonna clasp the hands underneath your legs, tuck the chin in the chest, and then pull back. Rounding the upper back. You're gonna feel this anterior deltoids, upper back area, and bring it back. Nice and slow, breathe. Okay, let's go ahead, bring the left foot into the right inner thigh, and then reach. If you can't reach to your foot, no big deal. You can use a towel, or you can just reach as far as you can without too much struggle. Remember, this is all about relaxing, so Go ahead, bring it back. We're gonna grab onto that right foot, come down to the ground with that left forearm, and pull. So we're getting that quad, that right quad. Make sure you relax the right leg. It's really easy to tense it up. It's like, oh, I'm stretching. But once you allow that leg to relax, you'll get a better stretch in. So go ahead and shake it out. Let's get the other leg. One leg might be a little bit more challenging to reach. Breathe. And slowly bring it back up. Let's go ahead, drop it down. Pull, get that quad. And breathe. Whew. Yay. Go ahead and shake it out. All right, let's open up those hips a little bit. Whew. So open up those feet as wide as you can. Obviously, I'm not going to face the camera as I feel like, hey. <laughs> All right, so go ahead. Keep your upper back straight as you can. Walk it forward. With every inhale, grow tall. Every exhale, crawl it forward a little bit more. Inhale, grow tall. Exhale, bring it forward. Now relax that neck. 
and bring it back. All right, feet together. Let's go ahead, come right to the knees. Now, if this is uncomfortable to sit in, you can always bring it up or you can stand up all the way. Clasp the hands and back, pull down, drop the neck over to the right. Relax that jaw. Back to center. Over to the left. Back to center. Nice job. Shake it out. Let's get that right leg in front. Press into it. Make sure the knee's not over the toes. Left arm across the body and pull. You can look over that left shoulder. Whew. Breathe. And shake it out. Before we go to the other side, same arm up and back. Pull, get those triceps we did work on today. Shake it out. All right, let's switch. Go ahead, right leg back. Left leg forward, press into it. Right arm across the body and pull. Some days you just need to take those extra big breaths. Just to relax. Shake it out. Keep pressing forward. And same arm up and back. Pull, get those triceps. And go ahead and shake it out. Let's bring it back. Curl the toes underneath. Push those hips back. Straighten out the legs. Get the hamstrings here. Relax the neck. Slowly roll up one vertebrae at a time. Four, three, two, one. Roll out the shoulders. All right, guys, we've got one more stretch, and then we are done. Clasp the hands in front. Pull the shoulders in. Big inhale up. And exhale. We are done for today. Yeah, we did it. You guys did. We completed our crazy, awesome barbell hit workout. So please do like this video. Thumbs up. And also pet the kitty to subscribe for more awesome workouts. We will be doing a lower body barbell workout in the future, uh, probably in the next week. And if you could share this with your friends and your family on Twitter or Facebook or whatever you use, that would be freaking amazing. So thank you. How'd you guys do today? Did you like the moves? Were, how is your upper body? Is it good? Is it burning? I want to know. And remember, you can always repeat this workout or you can go to another hit workout. All right, I will see you guys soon and I hope you have an amazing day. Roar!